Coming up on today's episode, I'm going to show you how to clean and care for your convertible roof seals to prevent and stop leaking. Okay, so the first thing you need to realize is when a convertible starts leaking, it's generally because the seals have dried out and they've perished. What that can then start to lead to is mold and damp inside the car, and then it can start to lead to problems like electrical problems and so on, and nasty smells and odors. So to cure this, what we need to do is we need to clean all of the seals all the way around the roof. We then need to protect them and make them more supple and softer, making sure that the roof gets a better seal when it's closed and it joins the body. So that's what we're gonna do. This is our Saab 93 Aero Convertible and it has a leak. The car has been standing over winter and the seals have dried out. Mold has taken over the steering wheel and we need to take action to stop the leak. Fortunately, a leaking convertible is generally easy to fix and unless there are problems with the roof material, the frame, the mechanism or if the seals are damaged, then you can fix a leak with a little care and easily available products. A couple of things you'll need to complete the task are an all-purpose cleaner, I would recommend if you have a concentrate to dilute it to around 1 to 10. It's pretty strong, but you'll need to remove some stubborn dirt and mould. If you're not into detailing much, then soapy water will also do the same thing, but for ease, you'll probably want to put it in a spray bottle. A shorter bristle detailing brush or a toothbrush, I'd recommend both. Some microfiber cloths, these are going to get really dirty, so if possible, use some old ones that are near the end of their life. A rubber protectant. For this, you could use any rubber dressing. Sonax Gummy Fledge is designed with this task in mind, but you can use bumper dressing or something similar like VRP from Chemical Guys. Optionally, you can use a Gummy Fledge Sift or Vaseline, but this really is more suited to winter. So, on with the clean. The reason most convertibles leak is because the rubber seal between the roof and the car are not performing properly. This is generally because they've dried out and they're not as supple as they once were. Start by opening the roof. Using your all-purpose cleaner, you need to liberally apply it to the seals and start cleaning. It's best to use a short haired brush as the shorter bristles help to scrub the dirt from the seal. You need to make sure that you clean all of the faces where two seals meet as this is the area where dirt and debris can congregate, causing a bad seal and in turn causing leaks. Once you've cleaned the part of the seal you're working on, wipe it down with the microfiber towel before it dries, this will remove any of the dirt whilst it's suspended in the cleaner. Using a toothbrush, clean down all of the gullyways in the seals. This is an area where water is designed to run down and it's also an area that can be prone to causing leaks. You really have to ensure that you clean all of the seals along the roofline and also inside the doors and windows. One of the next things you need to check is that the water channels are not blocked and are free from dirt. This can be done simply by pouring some water down the channel and checking that it comes out the other end. If not, then there may be a blockage. Some blockages can be cured with a large syringe full of hot soapy water. Use the syringe to force the water in and push any blockage out. Incidentally, this is one of the main causes of sunroof leaks in cars and it's always a good idea to routinely check that the drains are working properly. Now, once you've cleaned all the visible seals, you need to close the roof, but just before it closes, clean the part of the roof seal where it joins the body. But, please be careful to keep all fingers etc out of the way as the roof will still try to close itself. Now, continue the cleaning along the seals where they meet the top of the windows. Concentrate on the areas where the seal splits, this is normally where the roof folds, and ensure that they are clean. Finally, when the seal is dry, you need to protect them with your chosen care product. Just to show you on this door seal, I've used Chemical Guys VRP at the top, then Sonax Gummy Fledger next. And finally, the Gummy Fledger Sift at the bottom. I'd recommend using either of the top two for day-to-day -day use, and when autumn or winter comes around, give the seals a thick coating of either the Gummy Fledger Sift, or really, I recommend that you use a thick coat of Vaseline on the seals. 
apply a thick layer of Vaseline, shut the roof for winter and it'll stay dry until spring. If you repeat this process every 4-6 to six months, then your convertible will stay drier for longer. Are you listening? Damn. Uh.